Hi guys, welcome back to the third Euro 2024 shirt review. We're bringing these to you pretty quickly just because it's a hot topic at the moment and you guys are checking out these shirts. So no surprises which country we're reviewing this video we've got. That's it, the 2024 Germany home shirt. Now, I love this shirt. Um, and, you know, Germany didn't have the best World Cup, let's be honest. But this shirt, I think, is just different level. Now, we looked at the Spain shirts and the Spain home shirt, very modern, very typical, what you'd expect. And I would say this Germany shirt is following the same line. Now, look past some of the creases from, obviously, the packaging and how it was sent. But for me, this is probably one of the most stunning Germany shirts for a few years. And the reason for that, we'll come to it in more detail, is, is this colour scheme. But, you know, all German shirts, as you'd expect, dominated by uh, a lot of white and bringing in, in a very creative way, those colours of their flag. Now, this is the Adidas template. There's a couple of things on this shirt that I really, really like. So let's focus in on those colours first. And before I go any further, this is the, the fan, the stadium version here. So the £80 effectively replica kit here. But if you look on the top of this sleeve here, and it, you know, it, it goes all over the shoulder and it basically provides the background for that, the three white pinstripes. You've got that lovely gradient of the black through sort of red to orange to yellow. Now, this is really drawing inspiration from the 1994 uh, Germany shirt. Um, if you can remember it, it had that nice that gradiented colours coming down, almost like a V-shape across the neck. A really, really lovely shirt. And I just think that the, the treatment of this colour palette and, and the way it's incorporated in here it does it in a nice, simple way without detracting from the rest of the shirt. They've not tried to overcomplicate it. And I really love that. It is more, you know, it's, it's always going to be slightly more apparent on the front of the shirt. But And then it just allows itself to just then flow into the simplicity of the shirt. You know, I'm assuming we'll have, you know, we'll have the centralised, probably black number in there. And then you've got this side panelling. And that's the second thing for me is you've got this lighter weight material here for this white side panel. And again, I just, I really like it. I think it's really neat the way it breaks up um, the white here. And looking, now I'm holding this up in the light, I can see that on this white, we've got an underlying pattern there that I think draws from from the the the, the, the Deutschland crest or some. I think it's, it's, a, it's a pattern I'm familiar with. It's not evident on the back. And as you can see there, no, no black being corporate around, although that lovely thinner material, it's, it's almost mesh-like in its design. Really, really, really nice. So this, this is a, a, a safe home shirt in terms of colour scheme, but one that really does draw from an iconic shirt. And I think as, as, as host country, um, I think this is a shirt we're going to see a lot of. Um, and I think, you know, it, it, it is up there. It's up there with some, one of the best uh, Germany shirts um, that I've seen, that I've certainly seen, and and I don't, I, th I think it's unfair to compare it to the 1994. I think the 99, 1994 shirt was a different level, but I love this. I do love this. Now this is an extra large, um, and as you'll see from the thumbnail, it fits if, if, if good. If it's good for me, uh, as I say in every video, comfort. I go for comfort. You can see this this Germany shirt here is an extra large. And it's nice and loose, and, and, and that's what I like. So um, this one fits the same. I just took the shots before filming this of me in this top for that thumbnail. And yeah, feels really, really, really good. I think if, if I'm... Maybe I could be critical and say, you know, with, with all that lovely colour, it then comes down to sort of quite understated flimsy cuff there. Maybe more could have been done. I quite like... The neckline here, you just got that black and white, but then it just tails off to quite a simple white. And again, you know, maybe that could have come round, but then I think that it might have drawn the eyes in a, in a slightly different different direction. So I really like that. You've got that lovely embroidered big Deutschland badge with all those dots. I think, you know, the black either side works really well. And on the back, 
collar there, you've got your Deutschland. So like in all these reviews, we're going we're gonna to get the camera up for some close-ups so you can see a little bit of uh, the colour scheme there. Hopefully that sort of imprinted uh, montage or image, whatever you want to call it, comes through. If it doesn't, go check it out online. I'm sure you'll find it somewhere. But there you go, Germany home. How are Germany going to do in the tournament this year? Who knows? They can't do much worse than they did last time around. So there you go. Now, the next video, we've got the away shirt. And that is an eye turner for sure. Controversial maybe, but we'll discuss that when we get to that video. But until now, thanks for watching, guys. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on that Germany away review. And until the next video, we'll leave you with a few nice close-up shirts. Thanks for watching, guys.